Hey there, this is just a quick video of uh, Adobe After Effects and how to export your animation as a GIF and how to export it as a GIF with a transparent background. So the first thing you're gonna do after you've created your animation, as you can see, I have an animation, it's finished, it's an emote, and I'm just gonna hit pause and I'm gonna make sure I've clicked on my composition. So clicked on it and then go file, and we're gonna go to export, add to render queue. And then from here, it's gonna be added in. You can leave best settings or you can go in and tweak it really how you want. But the important settings we need to go in and change is where it says lossless. Click that, change AVI to PNG sequence. Yes, PNG sequence, just stay with me. I will show you the rest. And then change RGB to RGB and alpha. That's so you can get that transparency for the background. So click OK. Then you can like rename whatever, save the file where you want to save it to. Then click render. I'm just going to click OK and write over what I have. So that's rendered. So now you're going to make your way over to a website called easygif.com. I'll put a link to it in the description so you can find it. But once you get here, go to the GIF maker and go choose files. And we are going to look for the files that we uh, created, that we exported, that image sequence. So here mine are, I'm just gonna expand this out. Basically, I'm just gonna select all of them. There might be like 24 frames. You might have 60 frames. Oh, there's 60 in this case. So you can just bring those in, uh, open and upload and make GIF. So that's just gonna take a second, give it a second to do that. And then don't click on any of the images, just scroll down and you can change the delay time if you want to mess with that. Um, but you're gonna wanna click this one, don't stack frames and that's for transparency. So we can go make GIF and you can just quickly see how the speed of the animation is because we're doing this through like sort of like an after the fact strategy. Yeah, that looks really slow. I usually find I have to change this to like four or five or six or something. So let's try four. Um, so we'll change that way better. That looks great. So now you can see I've got this as an animation exported. It's going to be a GIF. It's going to be a transparent. And then we just hit save and it downloads. That's really all there is to it. It gives us information like file size and things like that. And then you can resize and so on. So that's all there is to export a GIF and with a transparent background in Adobe After Effects. It's just a bit of a workaround strategy. So if that helped you, leave a like, leave a sub, and maybe check out some of my other art tutorials as I am a digital art, hold on microphone, I'm sorry, I hit it just now, digital art tutorial uh, YouTuber. So hope that helps. Bye guys, have a good one.